Ah, oh, I should be Time to get things going. To do a little ritual or something. We'll see. We'll get the rules started. Hmm. But how I want to do this. Or I should even go, Hajime Mashtenshi, how are you doing? It's time for a couple of these events and also, of course, Emily Rolls. Ooh, huh. Okay, I got the bowl of ice, water, but it's feeling hot today. So Emily's shop is down around. I'm gonna go right by the shop and we'll do these rolls. Thank you. And then you'll go right to sleep. Let's make this happen. Okay. Okay. Oh, right. I need to do test run, too. Where is she? Where is her shop? It, it is right here, right? Yeah, called Kanye. Yep, Emily's perfume about her. Perfume cannot reach. No fixed brand. Most famous designer. Okay. So. So, do this quick to get every little bit of Prima Gems I can get. Me when Wolf Boy. Okay. Okay. So, we got you, I got you, and hopefully we can fix some of this up. Thank you, and just like that, and sure, why not? So, mm-hmm. Just gotta make sure Mika gets his stuff back and we can get it going. Okay. There we are, and shoot that. Oh, oh my goodness. It. <sighs> Hoped I wouldn't have this problem again. Give me a second. It. <sighs> Come on. It's just. I always have this problem. Don't know what about it specifically. Okay, give me a second. Okay, because that means I do need to reset the source. This happens very specifically when I put stuff in Streamlabs. When I put the game on before I open up Streamlabs. So it's time to remove that source and make another sound source. I hate my stupid Chungus life. Okay. Add a new source. You know, at least I can fix it in app, but it's still just stupid that it forces me to do this. And... wait, what? Huh? I need to delete this source entirely now, do I? What? Come on. Give me a second. It... I actually kind of hate this stuff. The fact that audio, basic audio output capture can literally only capture the entire desktop is obnoxious. Okay. Okay. Add the source, and go to the Genshin window. Should hopefully do the... It won't do the trick. Because what that means is that I need to just relaunch the game, I think. I hate this so much, legitimately. Hopefully this will make it work, but I'm not quite sure. But I do think it's a problem that comes when I open up the game before I open up Streamlabs, which it's things are easier to set up and faster if I can open the game before Streamlabs, but it's not like look, that is actually going to be an option, and it's now taking... Oh, it's not launching. Come on. Okay, let's try this again. Is it just not launching because of the audio hook or something? Okay, now it's opening. Okay, it should work now. Just, they really make me go through a lot just for all this, I swear. You know, why? I don't deserve this. I don't deserve this treatment. Okay. Uh, now I can hear it again, presumably. I would think. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Let's try all that garbage one more time. And, oh, are we inside the domain still? Oh, it sent me right back to the domain. For what? Eating fried rice? Okay, good. Mm -hmm. 
Throw some of this and sack did not frog. Of course it didn't. Mm. Mm. Okay, good. You tried to berate me for eating fried rice. I might hurt you physically and mentally. Okay, and blast. Thank you, I keep on hitting. It Razor the funny thing about Razor to me, especially, is that he's actually pretty good if you do a reaction-based build. Otherwise he just does not have much going to him. But the reaction builds are arc good. Is that that's the end of you? Thank you. Maybe. I don't know. Depends on the situation, depends on the weapon probably. Thank you. Keep blasting. And it, just having to claw through all these guys slowly but surely is so funny, because it's just not, not the best way to run him. You want to run him reactions with Dendro. Stress you enough to... Yeah, that would probably be easier. Doesn't mean I'd like to do it, though. I'd feel bad. Thank you, and... Cool. But it's all just trash enemies. It's the funniest part. Okay. Well, I'll get to rolling in a second. Okay, fair. Hello. We're just doing the test runs to let people file in and get some stuff. A couple more Prima Gems. That's not a very nice thing to call her. And thank you. Chop that up and can do this. Okay, cool. Let's end. Okay, okay, nice. Oh, that didn't quite work. Thank you, and boom, one, two, boom, one, two. Mm, this is interesting. Oh, wow. And we can keep on hitting some of them. Okay, come on. And hit, hit, and take you down. Oh, ouch. That's sad. And there we go, cool. Just because... Which one of us? Which one of us are you gonna punch? Okay. Let's try this out. I'm getting this down and... Thank you. Ooh. I actually killed one. Thank you. Keep on getting this battery going. And who and where? Mm. Give me particles, please. Okay, which one of us? Honestly, I don't think you could. Just saying. Good good luck. Okay, and blast over here and shoot. Put this down. Okay, cool. Lots of silly reaction spam. It He's interesting, but I wish he was better. I actually have his console. But it only does so much. By people larger than you. In what sense? Sadism? Maybe don't answer that question. And... There we go. So... Oh, hi! Hello. We're rolling for Emily now. Well, in a second, because I'm doing her test run first. Long time no see- Oh, nice! What weapon are you using on her? She's gonna be fighting for deathmatch with Zhao. For me, personally. Thank you, and... Can I... Put that case down? Cool. Let's keep the burning up. And oh, but right, Kirara wants... A bit more of that. It... That might be a dangerous belief. Thank you, and... Oh, ooh. Take that down, and... Blast with a mantra. Okay, cool. And take you down and good damage. Keep that going. And where are we? Well, Emily needs to put her case back down. That's right. It. Don't push your lock. It's all I'll say. And her damage is good. I might have to have some sort of throwing competition. Okay, have fun. So, there we go. We got everything we need to get the rolls going. Before you leave, I'll mute you. Okay. Before you leave, I'll mourn you. 
You violated a rule. But I can't scroll down. Come on. Okay, here we go. Well, it... We do a, we do a bit of persecution. Ourselves. Okay, time for the rolls. So who... Is there anyone who would particularly sort of... Match her... Sort of a logical connection? To see... I think it would be... Well, in that perfume event she had, it was... Give perfumes to Navia, Fiorina, Sigwin, and I think she has a connection with Chiori. For needlessly inflammatory comments. You were you were starting fights. I can't let that happen. I need to keep the peace sometimes. If only sometimes. Don't take it personally. Okay, so we have. A lot of... Yeah, you know, see? Sometimes. Sometimes the shoe is on a slightly different foot. So we got 200 there, and then after it's 55, so... 40, 50... 54... 254 with the Prima Gems alone, 264 with these, and 52 more. So around 300 if necessary. Well, don't push your luck. So I will simply go up, put my tracker back down. What is my pity at right now? Pretty sure it's a dead zero. Let's get these rolls going. So on, oh, we got nine on the event character because I got Sigwin from the ninth. Well, I got Sigwin first in a 10 roll, so let's get this started. Is right to 19. Okay, that's simple. Right to 19. Who is this? Oh, Yanfei. Well, it's I've gotten so many Yanfeis. It's actually crazy. Oh, and a from it, from it, from it. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, so that should be C3. That was a lucky from it connected to nothing. That was nice. Don't hate that. If I got early pity, then you would be happy for me, because you're emotionally mature and kind-hearted. Isn't that right? And that's... okay, Razor and... okay, Dragon's Bane. I've actually gotten some good use out of him. Here we go, 39 and... oh my goodness, not the lag. Growling inside for what? Me assuming the best of you? Probably unwisely. Yeah, go ahead. Okay, and just more Star Glitter. But every one of those is an extra roll. A little bit closer. Okay, so that's 49. Hmm. And that's... A Widsith, not necessarily bad, more Yanfei. Give me another Fremine, please. I know it has nothing to do with anything, but please. Speak for yourself. It takes one to know one, frankly. Okay. So... Okay, just another razor, and this will take us to the funny number. Come on, don't lag. And, yeah, can't be lucky every time. For, for who? For whom, I mean. Let's be grammatically correct here. Go oh, straight to 70. I don't know what's up with my connection today. I don't think that's how it works. I don't think it's connected to anything. I think luck is a non-existent phenomenon. If you say so. Okay. Let's get 73. And 74. I think we're going in deep. No, because then you would have to leave. Why would I do that? Why would I be unnecessarily cruel for no reward whatsoever? Let's see who this is. Oh, there we go, nice. You didn't even have to leave. See? Okay. Nice thing is, that's a 50-50 win. 
Okay, so it was Emily at 66. Let's write that down. 76. By what? You leaving? By you just in general? Okay. And there we go. Get that down, kit her out, and add her to the teams. Cool. That means... Yeah, we still got a good amount for... Not on banners. Okay. Let's just... I did pre-farm for her. Last patch. Fontaine Perfumer, one who bottles secrets. That also means a few blue fate rolls quickly. Let's do this. There we go. Looks like a librarian. So Aoi is holding her current pieces. Gotta find what Aoi is holding on to right now. Did a danger of something. Let me see. And I did. Okay, right. It was a pearl cage. Thanks. I don't need hero worship though. I can't endorse that ideologically. And let's give her a better pull arm. Not that one. Okay, this is not any good. But but now she's actually best with deathmatch. That's her best four star option. We will continue leveling her. Well, have you ever heard heard the statement that every virtue is the balance between two extremes? Thank you. Mm -hmm. Something before. Okay. And yep, we got lots of things stored up. Don't think I'd crown her, but I think I can get her to 999. Come on, come on. Advice. What do you mean by that? Advice? I think she said advice. Th thoughts? She's very taciturn. Very economical with words. I... I don't know. I think... I think it's a... An interesting and tough situation. Had a lot of those lilies. I don't know what's up with the connection today. That having power. Hmm, I'll do my best for something. Okay. Definitely a little librarian in her. Honestly, she's Fontaine Sucrose. What do you think about that idea? Oh, and I need to make more of the green gems, that's right. Then we can do a few blue fate rolls. Alright. Well, I never said that you had to choose one. You are not beating the illiteracy allegations. Okay, let's make these and put that down. We've got a bunch of teachings of order, general order books, so make that happen. But I need to put someone Pyro in the party to make her work at all. Okay, there we go, cool. Many things, many people, strong light, clearly. Clearly see. Something about light to gather. Do you think differently, I think? Hmm. And alright, there we go. We got Emily straight to 90. Let's take her to 9992, I think. It's gonna be kinda crazy for me, except for not one characters. Shadow Hunting Spear, and I'm pretty sure it's because of a Marsha Say Hunter connection. Because her special weapon, Lumidusa Elegy, is explicitly a weapon of Marfisa, who was a champion duelist character. 
Let's see, how long that lasts? It's gonna... How long? Lasts... How long does the case last? Oh, 22 sec... 22 seconds. You know... Maybe that makes for the second Dendro Archon. I am not stinky. I am many things, and many of them bad. I am not stinky. I pride myself on my hygiene. Oh, I didn't know she needed gears, but if I run out, I could always just tear up some fish. It... Generally speaking, effective insults have to have some basis in reality. Just a word of advice. That lasts 2.8 seconds, okay. Huh. Recreated, stowed away, or deployed instead, including a level 2 one if possible. Hmm. I... I don't think it works like that. I don't think that's how that works at all. But yep, we've got lots and lots of Arlequino plumes. Yeah, well, I'm glad you agree at least. You have some level of openness to reason. We can we can work on that one in the future. And I'm pretty sure that everyone who uses gears, because I have every Fontaine character, used everything that needs gears. It. I think you're. You're forcing yourself into living a very insincere life, if you live like that. I think you're only hurting yourself in the end. Oh, but that's right, I can actually only take her to 888 right now because... Actually, let me see. I could do some conversions, maybe. Depends on how much I care about. Leveling her right now, uh, it, she is fine for the time being. This is a okay. Now I gotta put someone in here and. Do I want a shield or. or you know, I could be really funny and put in Toma. Yeah, there we go. Toma is the shielder. Okay, well, as long as it works for you, I suppose. Where is. She right there or. Oh, right, Fremine Constellation. And that's just a little bit closer. It's not this yet, but... His cons aren't all that crazy, except for... Well, even the final one isn't crazy crazy. It's just a good... So, let's... Use those five blue fates to get a couple more rolls in. See how that works. Okay. So... We are currently at 21 on the normal banner. Well, do you? Last time I checked, you didn't. So we're just talking past each other. Neither of us are qualified. Okay. 23. Twenty-four. Oh. 24, nothing. 25. Okay, just a purple. And that's. Did they tell you to not care about making sense or just care less about unimportant things? Because I happen to think that making sense is actually very important. Just saying. That's my perspective. My personal perspective. So, I guess we could try testing out my new Emily on characters, commissions. There are a crackling crisis. Oh, but she's not going to work all that well because it's going to force her to trigger quickens. Well, okay. It, I think it depends on the person. And here she is with her brand new, well, not brand new spear, but brand new Emily with the deathmatch I already had. Hmm. I like how there are flowers on that swing. 
Even if she would never be using her normals unless she was at C6. Alright. Make this happen. Get over here, you clown. And... There we go. Cool. And just put that down. Thanks. Oh, I like this. We are triggering virgins. That's right. Cool. Thanks. Who is burgeoning? Who is burning? Yeah, we can actually use this as part of a virgin sort of team. That's right. Because there are people who would use this for... Oh, for... Kinich. Kinich. Kinich is actually... Very, very competent on virgin and burning teams, because, like, Emily deals just normal big green numbers as Dendra. Yeah, brand new Emily with brand old spear. Hmm. There is thunderous ignition. Yeah, it's just a matter of actually being able to proc burning on the enemy. The virgins were good. I... I don't know. I like that Milani's name is Hawaiian. It's fun. Go down here and... Let's try it like this. Hello there. Hmm. Try it like this. And... Short hold is good. Thanks. And... I can put this one down. Thanks. And... Cool. All right. Thank you. Uh, not quite want that. Okay. Uh, okay. Fair enough. That's life. Uh, can I put this back down? Hmm. Kinda works. Kinda. And it. Uh, it's doing okay damage, but. Actually, maintaining burning is hard unless it's just a couple of enemies. In the end, she won't be in the team forever. Okay. I feel like some kind of pyro character with a good pyro app would be nice to have here, but having both Kira and Emily in for friendship makes that hard. Well, okay. Just gonna push this through. Get that done as well. Oh well. Oh well. Mm. AI Hytham. And, oh, that didn't hit anybody or anything. Okay. Mm. That. Top. I. As dumb as it might sound, I don't know. It is what it is. Okay. Try this out. I bet. Put that there down there, and then just have Emily help out a bit. Thank you. And well, oh my goodness, pretty good damage. Okay. Hmm, any more of these in here, and... Oh, I'm surprised that that little floaty thing, that little option, doesn't automatically shoot at the barriers. Huh. Either way, I've got a good amount of rolls set up for that one now, so... I don't think I'll be in trouble. Winning that 50-50 was nice. It's about where I wanted. So we'll see how deep I need to go in for Milani. And can you each... And apparently, Sheila and that lion woman is supposed to be 5.1. Fair. Hmm. Hmm. This one's over here. This should actually be pretty good for Emily. We'll see. Epic dog fight. Hmm. Either way, tomorrow. I should hopefully be raiding Dom's base. Or at least finding it and seeing what's inside. He said that he has no intention of moving it at this point, which is good news for me. 
It's not a betrayal at all. He didn't expect anything else. It's only a betrayal if they expect fair play. He never expected fair play. Okay, and can I... Thank you, and where are the rest? Come on, come on, keep that burning up. And big green numbers. That's... Decent for off field. Well, he can try. He can try that. I honestly don't think there's much he can do other than just try to have something kill me in his absence. And it wouldn't be the easiest thing. The most he can do is impede me. Can't really stop me. The one thing would be... If he got a security system for his chest, but even then, I'm sure I could find some way around it within the rules he set up. Or I'd just break the rules. And pretend I found a way around them. I don't think he'd be able to tell the difference. Well, alright then. Gotta remember to put... Well... Offer him the money. Although I'd find it kind of unpleasant for someone else to be making money off my streaming instead of me. Yeah, you want you want to see you want to see me do funny things on stream, so you paid Don. That that's amusing enough that I could really really see it happening. There's a bit of dramatic irony there, probably. Okay. Mm -hmm. So in that case, it's just a couple of events I've got now. Yeah! <laughs> That's exactly what I'm saying. Bossom of the fifth Bing Bang Finchball. Hmm. The Maritime Harbor. Fontaine and... Bossima. Right, and Bossima the Fifth, because the original <laughs> Bossima was in the Summer Paradise, in the Lurian Mirage. But, maybe that's why you should do it. It would be funny. It would just make me angrier and put me off my game, which would make me more likely to die in the trap. Hmm. Where is she? Oh, down off the side. A lot of them are just down here for some reason. He would say yes. I'm a biology researcher, rising mercantile star, grand bizarre, remote hyper black. Teach thee not to leave too hastily. Max body, queer mind, wasn't closely, matter of boards to share. Finches are the cutest. Just like the gal from Gloria Mirage, sure. Researcher, merchant. Saying with plot qualifications can lead to arguments. Use precautions with words, generally don't exaggerate. Pylon's impression. My theory is the best, practice is greatest. Ask me anyone doesn't buy it, do the rest to discredit you. Deja vu, had this conversation before. Pylon's the cutest. Aw. My joke shouldn't be so loud, that's the spirit. You know that no absolute best, any theory I've returned, all products surpassed. Inject rule changes that people have things and people will praise most highly. Almost dear to no matter what others say, a bright disapproval was confidence never can be best selves, never find someone who truly sees them. Table game, Big Bang Finchball, wouldn't hesitate to shout out Finchers are the cutest. Table beside you, familiar from Valerian Mirage. How adorable Finches are. Now, the other two mini games in that circus pavilion also had little sort of descendants come, descendant successors come and so revive the event, tabletop game, highness scores can win rewards. Level 2, rewards aren't the priority, the game just needs to be fun, what do you think? Give it a go. Same page, hope you enjoy your experience to the fullest. Alright. Free and easy fun. Total coins. Hardly even. Ah, oh, first time you reach the stage goals, and... Oh, okay, you can try the easy mode. Some reach the stage goals. Hmm. Definitely want to try the multiplayer too, but... Let's just see what you have to say. 
played. Finches are the cutest. I've always been cute. Playing it somewhere before. Paid attention to finches in the wild. Played discovered first people miss. Bottom of the fifth. Be able to relive re re some of our previous adventures. Played before. You and family are connected. Additional game from maternal great great grandmother. Right, because that would be, yeah. Because she's the fifth. We had a welcome guest. And we play the game with her academic rivals and best friends. Gave away a few copies. Sure, adorableness of finches. Can superdrive spirits with love. Become more patient. We'll let fewer arguments. Proving and promoting. For sake of peace and cuteness. And do that. It's a thing. And the most busy of ports. Aquabus and car ship spread. Time is right. Distributing ports for free. You want to play at any time. Bring a few copies or flyers with you. Recommend to people you meet. Still looking to find more people. Okay. If I chose the other option. Oh, Hajime Masenshi, Evo Weon. We are doing a couple of mini games after I rolled for Emily. How are you? Hello! Hyperbole, pets, patient, kind, easy to get along with. And. Hmm. Well, technically, it's Japanese name order, so that's technically the family name. Not that it really matters. Hmm, easy to get along with. Okay, now hyperbole definitely has a point. Finch piece, and then it ends the same. So this gal is a scientist who we talked to before. Well, the great-great-granddaughter of a scientist from a previous event, who is presumably now dead because we saw her ghost, basically. Son of a aristocratic family, some of nobility, nothing that amazing, just a title. Your great grandmother. Come on, you like that emoji way too much. Not the type of your older Ben, arrivals did she a fan, couldn't get rid of her. I know you do. Up to the desert, researching life form that didn't even exist, went missing immediately. Snipe hunt. Thought she was dead, reappeared with the report in the game. Hid in the mirage, completed her task, personality change, become enlightened. Never got angry, just played finish ball. <laughs> The research resolved with ease, and people eventually started playing the game. Really that effective. Better than I expected. Cute finches bring about world peace. Respect for her. Give her a title. Fifth head. The fifth. It's going well. I apologize if you have something to sell. I'm not in a position to buy anything right now. I wish you luck, though. Along with copies of the name for research purposes, boss of the tenth, and the twenty would accomplish. Final mix thing down for a round. Custom across to bat. All the speed settled. Real deal, help you out. More reason, less anger. Insights will put indeed. Wisdom is precious. Quote you on the back of the packaging. Make people happier. Frustrating arguments into peaceful discussions. Okay. Let's go for it. Let's actually play the game. Okay. Free and easy fun. We normal finch balls. Ward preview. Totally, total obtained. Let's try the various boards for fun. Change mode, random stages. Huh. Boy delivery method. Finch balls. Cuteness and their special qualities. Solitary. Pell them in a set radius. Rival finch balls. Knock them out to win. Oh, okay. It's all about knocking them away. Manually select order. Cancel launch and reset the process. Recovered, invalid launch. Discard it immediately. Is it a cute bug? I will finch balls, knock it out of the scoring area, higher scores, greater reward. Friendly normal. Red zone, yellow zone, line between higher will count. Or it'll even, four rounds of launches, scores of each landing spot. Draw, last second, opportunity to launch first. Mm hmm, hardly even, a time limit, runs out of launch time, pass over. Launch will be discarded. A sticky finch ball. Oh, okay, well. Bugs can be cute. I maintain that bugs can be cute. Stick and carry it along, cancel until it stops moving. So is it appearance, attract others, and a set radius. Hmm. And then solitary that pushes the others. Let's get this started. Alright, launch all the finch balls. Oh. This. Ah, right, okay. Just gotta aim. And there we go. We can just repel them. Ooh, huh. That was harder. Hmm. 
Ooh, oh, I... Ah, come on. Knock them in and away. I hate my stupid alive. Round three. Oh, right, we can just aim this and... Will this work? Yeah, oh, no, no, no. Come on. Come on. Oh, no, we did knock them out. Oh, no, we have... If they come back in, it doesn't matter. It's just about knocking them out. Okay, good. Good. Okay. Let's go eat Zayton Peaches. Oh, so in theory, if you max out your score here, you can get all the rewards without playing multiplayer. Cute and friendly. Cancel once it stops moving. Watch all the Finch balls score as many points as possible. I feel like trying to bank it would be best. Okay. Interesting, but it's not the numbers, it's the scroll buttons. Well, wouldn't it be a bug walking on? A bug walking in would be scary. That would be an infestation. That's frightening. Okay. Aw. How do I want to do this? Big thing is we need the sticky ones. Think. Can over here and getting it to a little under half. Should be. Well, I. Well, that. Aw. Huh. Okay. 14 is sort of the goal here. I. Can I. Oh, there we go. I, there we go. Now, I was infested once. It was a rather unpleasant experience. And then two finch walks face off, one out of the scoring area, two of the opponent's finch walls out, three out. Enemy finch ball. Hmm, arrival, arrival finch ball. Watch all the finch balls. Do we? It's kind of scary. Is this the attracting or the solitary? I think it's the solitary one. Thank you. There we are. Get boomed. So then, vanish back and it has been removed. Okay. So in that case, to bump them all out, we need to bank this hard and oh we we did all of them we knocked them all out nice and well i guess we can put a couple more in but it was only about knocking them out that was quite nice threading feather light through the woods six eight twelve and that normal finch will right increase the score wanders aimlessly well, I would be fine with that, because I'm not a worm. The worms cause me problems. I, I think... You may be somewhat misunderstanding the situation. Maybe. Just like this. Gotta be... Deliberate about it. Let's be... Thank you. Oh, that was tough. Good. Let's retry this. I need about half of them. Maybe? This should be... Oh, it's... They lose so much from... Momentum for balancing. That makes sense, but still. Okay, and can I... Yeah, there we go. That's nice. So now at this point, we may as well just sort of bank them all in. Try to get a good amount of... Oh, please. Oh, there we are. And then, yep, 12 is our theoretical maximum here. It's really fun. It's basically shuffleboard. It's not a bad thing. Okay, and it didn't even get in. Well, it kind of did. Okay, cool. This dumbstruck finchy fury. Huh. Launch all the finch balls, knock as many out as possible. We got solitary one, and then after that, we would knock three out in theory. I think that mm, no no about a fourth or a third would probably work okay there we go and there we are we knocked them out which means let's try to hit them sort of diagonally maybe should have bank this as much as i can and I oh no because that was the gravy one i may be stupid dang it Okay, just hitting them in this direction should. Okay, we managed. That one at the end was not really good to have there. And confuzzled triangle formation. 
Okay. Launch all the finch balls. Score as many points as possible. Huh. That we got the one that attracts. That should help. I think that right over... Nope, nope, nope. About a fourth would be what we need. We want the one that attracts. Okay. No, no. I still did too much again. Come on. About a fourth. And there we are. Should bring them in. There we go. Cool. And it wants us to have 18. Oh. Oh, okay. Oh, but that's right. Then you have to sort of push them all into the corner. Right, okay. So, if we push them all into the corner, I... Well, huh. That was an interesting idea. Okay. For what purpose? Like I said, I have zero interest in buying anything right now. Don't push your luck. Uh-huh. Okay, so we actually need the sticky ones. Thank you, and... Oh, uh, we needed about half then. Maybe... Yeah, half is going to be ideal. This is where we need to go. Yeah, that worked quite well. Okay. Here we are. It, it's certainly something. And, mm, about a third then. We should be fine. Okay. Well, we still got our score bonus. Our, no, no, good God. That was so stupid. I didn't think that would happen. Forgot that one. I thought that one would just do nothing. I hate this so much. Ah, stupid finch ball. Okay. Here we are. Cool. Then. About a third should do it. Or not. Hmm. Okay. Just gotta make sure that this one does not tractor beam anything. Cool. Okay. And there we go. Uh, a food delivery squad. A food delivery squad. Okay. Launch all the finch balls. Okay, so the solitary ones would be good to have here. The big question is just... How could I make sure that doesn't push any of them back in? I think that half should... Half is too far. We need to do about a third. That should be good. Come on, come on. This should be where? It's pretty dead center. Uh, uh -huh. So in that case, moving them over. Ouch. Poisonous? I hope not. This should do it. And there we go. Uh, uh? Uh. And knock five out. Only four are gone, then. Huh. Okay, well, I... Thanks. Ah, there we go. Cool. But one of them is still in there. Somehow. Is it this one? I bet it's this one. Come on. Well, it wasn't, but we did it. Please don't claw your skin off. That sounds painful. Pinch Army's emergency wheel. And we're almost at max rewards. Emergency wheel. 24 points using finch balls. Huh. Oh, wow. That. Sorry to hear that. Hmm. Traction one would be good. But. Hmm. Could be very. Mmm, no, not like that. A fourth or a fifth at most. Okay. And this really just barely tap it in. 
Okay. And... Oh no. About half a second. Okay. Not... A lot of people are like that, actually. And will this... That pulled one of them in. Hmm. In that case, I'm not sure how I want to do the rest, actually. This is quite interesting. I think two-thirds or so in terms of power would do it. Yeah, that should work. Thanks. And... Ooh, okay. Huh. So to get... All those in. I have a few rounds left. I feel as if... This way would just be to get both of them in here. Maybe. It would take about... Maybe about half. No. About a third. Okay. And... We were so close. Okay. Hmm. Yep. I do find it interesting that... Getting them all in just legitimately is actually really hard. I actually have a lot of respect for that. And... Hmm. Okay. So in that case, let's try to pull this one over here. Should be good. I... Oh. Okay. Alright. Yeah! I don't disagree. What I'm saying is that it's interesting that they encourage you to interact with the multiplayer by making the base mode actually quite hard. Because there are a lot of people who don't enjoy multiplayer, and I'm dead certain that the reason this single player only mode exists is so that people who don't want to engage with multiplayer don't have to. But it's interesting how they balance that out by just making it pretty tough to actually get all the rewards. Scared of people? Fair. It... <laughs> Why do you need to know? I'm not buying anything from you. Okay. Come on. And just turn... Mm -mm. I think that was too far. Okay, and... A couple of these, and it should be... About a third each time. Okay. And this should do it. One more of these and we can chill. Just gonna make sure we get something. Red instead of the yellow. Okay, cool. And there we have it. There we have it. Okay. And yeah. Means we can take all of these rewards. Yeah. Thank you. 6200... 240, and then 70, 300, before, before I answer any of your questions, tell me in no uncertain words, are you here to try to sell me something? Free and easy fun. Then, let's see what the other modes are, maybe. Another round, and play to your heart's content. So we did all that. Let's just play these, then. Hardly even hardball. Usually play on the grass. Berry and wheat treats. Which ball's available? It's just a combat event. Currently unlocked randomly. Let's... Let's just try these. See how this works. Hmm. So they're first. Oh, so we launch from the same side. Okay. Hmm. Oh, alright. Hmm. Okay. And about this much should be good. Just knock them out. Hmm. <laughs> X 
stage. We're gonna roll launch first next time. This one is simple, okay. Mm -hmm. And just like this. Okay. Mm -hmm. This is all just about figuring out how best to launch things in. Oh, are they trying to bank it or? No, they're not. Oh, okay. Oh. Now we're even. Hmm. Their turn. Last one is a draw. This is a cute little game. I wonder how they're going to be able to maybe knock me out. They are being tough with their time. Oh, they're hitting their own. <laughs> they knocked their own one out. Hmm. Question is, can I try to bank this shot and hit them? I, mm, no, that was a really bad idea. All right, all right. It's, I can't afford to go for anything silly. If I wanted to try to bank it out, I need to go over here and, uh -huh, okay. We did it. This may be it. Maybe in a good position here. And, well... Oh! That... Good job to them. I forgot that if you're on the line, if you're on the line, you pick the higher one. That wasn't true. Damn it. Oh well. Let's continue. Oh, right, because it puts us in a co-op mode. Okay. Try the next board. Try all the new boards. When it's sense of rest, well, rating upwards, jump point in the grass, pissing pond cones around your heads, popular pastime, bearing wheat treats, perfect party, wish you play on the grass. Level of warmth in cool conditions, should the winds change direction, to bring the snowy mountain cold, because it's not chill with them. Solitary finches tremble a touch. Some may seek out bonfires, but fly away to warm. Steak, should they encounter treasure hoarders, something tied together, more common method, keep the cold at bay. Okay. Hmm. So there were seven bolts, but eight actual multiplayer challenges. Interesting how that works. Okay. Hmm. You know, maybe no one's playing this board. Oh, but is it... Is it because I'm in this... Oh, okay, okay. For a second, I thought I was only looking for people actively in the world. It's not true. Okay, they're here. Oh, they got a Melusine. Profile picture, that's cute. I like that. Hmm. Oh, they even touched a four. Dang it. Hmm. Try to see how much. Probably about a half should be good. A little under a half. Okay. Hmm. So in that case, probably want to try to bank it in as much as it's sort of as far away from the edge as possible. Well, I feel like actually a third would be good enough. It's probably going to end up being a draw, isn't it? Probably. I don't think they have a great way to actually force me out. That's the thing. Yeah, they're trying silliness, and it's just not working for them. Oh, well. So about a third should be good here. Come on. And this... Yep. It... The amount of variance is actually really, really high. But that puts them in prime position to try to scatter things on the board, so I... Hmm. Well, be very, very hard for them to take this from me at this point. So. Oh, we got some of the captive balls. Okay, well, I... Hmm. That was angled rather incorrectly. There we go. Just go ahead, try it. And... Okay. I think they actually knocked me onto a higher scoring position. Which is rather funny. 
And, well, we won one. Won the face-off with the score bonus. I... I do like this multiplayer mode. It would have been interesting to try to use it to get my coins. But I'd feel like I'd have wanted to do the single-player challenges, too. I understand why they made the multiplayer... Made either side optional. But it feels that, besides just playing it and showing off how it works... I don't know. Wasted time is subjective. Hidden base behind a tree stump. Which is often nest in the tree traps. Find it hard to carry heavy bears have the branches with their small bodies. Clever clogs amongst them pick up withered branches and leaves to a secret base behind tree stumps where cats rarely come calling. Apart from certain delicious treats, bulb amongst finches also contain tools for finch use. Sample pond cone hats to protect mm -hmm. one's head when picking berries, or dried mint leaves for polishing one's claws. Be Didn't know leaves would do that. Huh. I'll probably have the juice in it. Pinecone hat. That's cute. Poseidon? Poseidon is real. Okay. Let's do this. Poseidon is launching first. Hmm. Easiest thing to do would be to try to get it in with. Oh, well. How sad. Try to uh, just knock it in from the side, but I... Oh, well, we... There we go. Okay. That was a bit narrow. Hmm. So trying to bank it in diagonally would be also interesting, but... Aw. Huh. I... There we go. Right in those corners, which might actually be kind of bad for me. We'll see. Hmm. We have a number of other kinds of balls, which we could try using strategically. Let's go ahead and do something, please. Begging you. Oh, and... Oh, uh -huh. now they're even. Aw. I... Should try to push them out. They're going first. Hmm. All this strategery. That... Ooh. Huh. Okay. So the solitary ball... Solitary ball... I got the impression that this is actually going to be the one which will deliver the day for me, so to speak, so... Can I... Yep, and now... They're all out, and I'm slightly ahead. Okay. Let's see how well they can manage with this. I think they're just trying to get one in. The end there would be my best bet, and I... Well, I... Ah, oh, good God. Damn it. Okay. Uh, the point at which things stop can be hard to manage sometimes. What? That! Huh. That was aggravating. Mm -mm. Okay. This... Not in a bad way, but it is pretty tough at times. It it doesn't have the longevity to be a permanent mode or anything, but I like it. Even if I am kind of getting a little shown up. Okay. Another round. Thank you. So there are four more multiplayer boards. Forestral etiquette. It is said there is a, that there is a small village in the forest depths whose inhabitants are finches, and there are twelve finch laborers, finch singers, finch architects. And the village in the outside world is but a single small path, one that may only be traversed by finches. If a finch mother should meet a returning finch neighbor, will send your finch children out. She will sift to the side a little, make face for a fellow finch. Thus, it was. It was that adventurers once unexpectedly discovered finches said no to the point etiquette of yielding the right of way. Okay, so some of these boards, yeah, a lot of these boards were used for the single player challenges too. Hmm. Well, all right. I'm wondering then how best to do this. I think a third would be the best. Yep, that's a pretty good spot. Hmm. What are they going to do now? 
try to bank it or what? And oh, great. Thanks. Hmm. Hmm. So I'm still touching the one one. Think. Gotta use my repulsion ball. Gotta be fair. Well, use the solitary one, yeah. It actually might be a bit early, but I'm not too serious about this. Thanks. And there we go. Okay. Hmm. City's so attraction and repulsion is interesting. But I think it would be easy for them to try to get both of mine. So let's should put it in here. Okay. Yeah, this should make it hard for them to push both of them away. As well, depending on how they aim it, that's the question. Might be able to force both of them in. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, I kind of figured as much. But also, if I'm very smart about this, I could use my final pole ball to bring them all in, maybe. Depending. What are they trying to do then? Pull them farther away, or...? Thank you! You helped me significantly. <laughs> yeah, I don't think they could have really done anything different with that. And that's... Great news for me! Awesome. That's the power of strategic use of finch balls. That... Very, very interesting. Hmm. Let's keep on going. A little bit more of my fried rice. Another round, and let's go for mildly ferocious triangle formation. Whether by injury or fatigue, finches sometimes cannot fly freely. They should encounter hostile creatures while in this unfortunate state. Their finches will form a triangular formation, defending their fellow finch with all their might. Now their party should close with a vanguard, they shall peck them in the eyes. They should weep over the front lines, and they shall peck at its paws, or just peck, that works too. Foes who are all bark and no bite may be overcome by small birdies with big courage and ferocious beaks. Hmm. Get this gone. Hmm. Suppose this one is going to be interesting to try to get into. Need some serious wall banking. Hmm. But hopefully someone shows up. So near the end of the event, so I'd say maybe that means more people should be showing up, but at the very same time, probably there's also fewer, maybe. It was on the very last day, I think there'd be a bunch of people. Maybe. Hmm. hmm. Just want to play a single match on each of the stages. It's interesting how that network connect connectivity noise has this little echoey kind of woo in the background. I'm really scraping the bottom of the barrel. Come on. Do people hate this stage this much? Maybe. Mm -mm. And it doesn't show a high score for any given stage. Good that we got the rewards though. That's it's only two more rolls, well it's like less than two and a half. It's two and three eighths of a roll, but mm, should have enough for Kachina and Milani to level them up as soon as I get them, assuming I have the materials. But it's just 
Really? Yeah. You'd think more people would be here. Maybe. Also, do have. Oh, because that's not a quest, it's just. the event itself. Interference overgrowth, common encountered bomb and smear with a rainforest. Giant boulder smashed to smithereens by rushing waters. Validation, observation, collection, extension, exceedance. Huh. Wonder what three combat rounds. Same character for all three rounds of combat. Motor force, adventuring prowess. Same character can only grant it once per stage. Like motor force, training guide for suggestions, so it's just encouraging people to level more characters. Three parties set up secondary effectors, resident effectors, apply to all three. Huh. It. Oh, really? Maybe I'll just move on to the sixth stage. See if someone does the fifth one. Eventually. Maybe. Okay, surprise, a surprise celebration. Although finches lack a precise sense of time and celebrate no birthdays, they do celebrate various happy occurrences. If a certain finch brings a large amounts of food back multiple times, his companions will prepare a big surprise for it near its dwelling place. When this finch returns from its labors and turns a corner, it will be greeted by warm greetings from its companions, and so they share precious delicacies they normally wouldn't indulge in, exchange ornamental gifts of broken shells or finally crushed gems, encourage one another such that they may continue living out their gladsome days. Okay. I hope someone is actually playing this stage. Oh, presuming what happens is they start from the first stage. Stop playing once they actually get all their rewards. Hmm. Kinda sad. Well. Okay. It did go through most of these stages. In the challenges. Finchy Smarties. Legend has it that fresh and matured finches will find partners and practice flying techniques. Under the guides of an elder, the three, three finches will form a line, the younger ones taking up positions at the front and rear, the elder in the center when they must change course. Line will shift to a diagonal one at the command of the senior member. Command of? Make turns more stable. Some adventurers inspired by this method have tried imitating the finches and forming teams and using wind gliders to portal to good effect. Hmm. Yeah, and it was every single stage except... This one, I think. It... This is sad. Okay, so someone actually wants to play the seventh one for some reason. Okay. Five and six seem to have nobody. Alright. Okay. Third should still be good here. Hmm. Okay. Here we are. Thank you. Cool. What are you going to try then? That's... Oh, well. Okay. <laughs> kind of sad. Mmm. Try just playing a random match. Mm. In that case, mm, hard to say. Honestly, keep this one nice and close to us. And cool. Mm. Others try to get close. Figure out some of that. Oh, and that was nice of them. He did pretty okay. Mmm, but should probably do is try to pull in some of the it's the blue ones that pull in about half and then try to pull them away well, I'm still ahead but oh it didn't help me all that much that may have been comically stupid okay and that did very little in that case, I... Winner will launch first. Ah, okay. Smart. Oh, goodness. If that... If I hadn't tried to do a really silly tactic... 
I could have won that. I really could have. Well, if I'm really, really smart about this, I could probably. Well, never mind. I hurt myself more, arguably. Well, okay. Hmm. That wasn't a particularly good showing on my end. Let's see if anyone wants to do the other stages. The funny thing about it is that the more often I win, the more I get to play, because it means, presumably, it makes it take longer for other people to get to the maximum they need. This stage is interesting. Hmm. Because how are we gonna get them in there? Probably using some of the attraction bowls. Hmm. Hmm. That was an interesting idea. I think that that might be the sort of do it if you aim for about a bit less than that. Well, hmm. hmm. Tough here. Get that in there. Kinda hard. Or to maybe over this way and then. Like that, and there we- oh, what? Okay. Huh. So that does not seem to be an adequate method. Okay. Hmm. But that blocks that, which means that if anyone wants to come through, they're gonna have to find some interesting methods. Okay. Hmm. Honestly, probably just bouncing it off the backboard would work best. Probably. Aim it there, and can I? Ooh, nice. And that. Uh, okay. We did pretty well for ourselves. Main thing is going to be trying to push away theirs. Hmm. They don't have a lot of places to get to then. Thanks. Ah, smart. Well, not really. Hmm. What could they do then? I'm gonna push them away, so actually... Best thing to do would be to push those ones out. Okay. There we are. Oh, and this pushes them in, but... Well, uh, uh, I didn't think that would really bounce in that way. Well, it... Depending on what they do, we'll either do pretty well or pretty badly. Thank you. I ooh, huh. Well, it didn't make a difference. Well thought. So that's three wins and three losses. Let's try the one stage I haven't done yet. Could it be the fifth board? Okay. Goodbye, Murasaki. Let's just try this one more time. See whether I have a slightly better ratio or slightly worse ratio. Okay. Oh, Esteban Quito. Period underscore. Hmm. Esteban Quito. Period underscore has entered the world. Here, Esteban Quito will launch first. Hmm. Uh, it's about two thirds, yeah. Actually, about half. Okay. Hmm. This should be where I need it. Yep, there we go. Nice. Okay. So they're probably gonna pay attention to how I launched how they're going to launch. Hmm. Okay, and about that there. Thank you. Cool. 
Simple enough. I think we could win this one. Maybe. Kinda sad. Hmm. This. Yeah. It. I wouldn't say it's gonna be a star, but. It would be difficult for them to bring this one back. Ah, uh, interesting. Oh, wow. That... That might not have been very strategic, I don't know, but... They tried something. Hmm. I... Best thing to do would probably be to drag one out rather than push one in. Take that there, their score goes down by six. Yeah, I need to make sure that their stuff pulls out. That should do pretty well. I No, no! Damn! Ah, we were so close to. Well, you know, it's a humiliation on the Zerf for underestimating Esteban Quito, period underscore. Okay. Well, Time for the combat. Hmm. Right, so let's go out of multiplayer mode. He is over in... Also in Fontaine, right? And Wait, she... Oh, okay. For a second she was gone. That was more than a little confused. Energy amplifier Lemma on the habit domain and a remote location highlighted the Layla is ideal to support the Hassani amplifier technical trials. Alright. Cool. Hello! Three combat rounds, many points as possible, time to score points, challenge to begin, set your parties up, same character for all three rounds of combat, mode of force, only once per stage. Green God for suggestions, parties up, set them up. And then set secondary, only after all three have set up secondary factors, keep it resident factor. Hector's in place, bust from resident factor, so apply to all three parties. Okay, so he's got some interesting optional dialogue. Not you. Wonderful, excellent timing. Just about to head to the Avengers Guild with Miss Commission. Oh, well, well, Commission coming right to us, getting eating good tonight. It's right from Avengers standards when it comes to fees. Don't worry about that. As you manage the various experimental modules as you did before, we'd be well compensated, I guarantee it. Where we met. Found me again, research from Sumeru. The other bunch of towns already, you know. We just must recall the energy amplifier. Yep. Amplifier man, one from the chasm. A cheerful glass, no what we didn't recognize you. Said happy, haven't missed a look in a long while. Did you have non gray hair last time? Happened, tell us. Long story, heard last time. Straight to the academia, proposed the ideal and artificial energy amplifier based on data we collected. Never seemed excited at first, highest. Praise right on the spot, and then booted me out of Samara to make him run errands in Fontaine. Didn't he praise you? Did praise me? Golf but fantasy is project proposal. Now praise. Hit of despair for some time. Good fortune accounting partners and investors here took up the project immediately. To read my previous research for Fontaine techniques, artificial energy amplifier, Hosseini amplifier. So pass the test, calculation predict it should, forget the trials, got a wisdom, may become a sage, haven't even graduated though. Need a fuss over confounding variables, tiny twists on the road to success. Need to experiment with mentally verify the performance of the amplifier, so volunteers test it in domains. Do you test it? Okay, cool. I think faith and capabilities. Design is not up to mark, be careful. Hmm. The experiment going. Expectations, functioning stably, data is clear, no I'd be thrilled seeing how you fight. For the device to improve. I'm good. It's true, keep at it and work hard. Other one is where he says spotting issues is good, precisely. Happens to have some ideas about experience productive. Thank you. And then, cough anymore. Mention it, cough's gotten better since the amplifier started making progress. Doctors say, true is the best medicine. Hope it all goes well. Thank you. There's a mean option where we talk about him not graduating. Okay. Might need my mentors me to cooperate theoretically. If it performs up to par, have to be happy where he wants to be or not. All right. Amplifier Lemma. Energy Amplifier Lemon. Experience Overgrowth. The Rainforest. 
Tangential related reaction. Fearless. Well, elemental resistance decreased. It's Koi. It's a little 90 is the maximum there. Hmm. I wonder what a good burning burning team would actually be here. Hmm. Feel for Thazzle is an option. Maybe. Hmm. Kind of Bloom team definitely should go in. Hmm. Doing damage, unstable energy transfer, time of reset, ration reduced, damage increase, your damage is dealt, so healing is kind of needed. Hmm. Pick. Second should be that Shinobu team. Quick Bloom. This could be a funny virgin team. Hmm. Not there though. The motive force. Hmm. Bennett. Maybe actually Shenha then. Shenha. Desley. Bennett and Emily. Sure. The question is how I'd be able to get burning on somebody and how. Probably honestly be better with multiple pyros, especially for the battering. And yeah, we have Emily there. Final one. Well, that lets you switch that there, but monster list and the virgins. No, we want them here. Definitely. Lots and lots of necessary teams. Hmm. I not sure John Luke's damage would be important in any real sense, so take them off here. And then try to just run it with every character difference. You can get a maximum of 48 motive force, which is nice. Not that it would make a huge difference either way. Hmm. Let me just think. So a Dendra related team for this one. Maybe pure hyperbomb could be interesting, but it's just a matter of Burgeon, Burgeon Toma would work here, but <sighs> does not account for everyone. Hmm. Hard to say. Koi is not good here. Leveling is crucial. Huh, because it's Toma than someone else. I guess maybe Yao Yao could work. She's not as good, but it could work. And then Xing Chao and Toma. Yeah. A bit scuffed, and I think. I don't even know how long Yue Gui lasts. That's a thing. Let's. Oh, but. Oh, does she not have a weapon, fully leveled weapon or artifact on her right now? That might be the case. How long does Yue Gui last? That's. Yeah, 10 seconds, that's not much. In that case, Shincha should probably be first on the team. But, it's okay. Uh, she does have the deep wood, which is good, because Baiju's got that. Okay. Thank you, thank you, and then Baiju. Uegui Toma. Maybe Toma Uegui, actually. That is the durations. This should hopefully serve, but you want... Oh, you do have the Fab Lance on right now. Everyone else should have suitable equipment, but you maybe want the slightly higher refined Fab Orbo. Okay, and then all of you 
Well, actually, you might want Fablands. Just in case. Maybe. Shed has not on anything here right now. Not a question, just energy. Amplifier Lemma. Wondering how much. She Amplifier Lemma. What is the highest possible score in metal? Metal. Does not say anything about platinum metals. Platinum. Is there no platinum? Okay, there is no platinum. Probably because it made people feel bad. Fair enough. Oh, primary effector. Current mode of force. Huh. Interesting. EM, EM for sure. Then here. Oh, so you pick a buff per team. That has to be attack. And that, EM, and secondary effector. Not yet unlocked. So I assume you need max motive force to get every single one together. <laughs> Mental reaction, that should work. Mm -hmm. Six. Idea everything except EM. Skills and verse, max five stacks. It Healing won't do much. Hmm. Up to every. Hmm. Should be good. And this. Yeah, damage bonus. Yeah. Okay. And this resonant effector applied to all three. Hmm. All elemental resistance. Triggering reactions, because all of these are pretty reaction oriented. Yeah, okay. Oh, so you need. You can afford to have one character shared over all of them if you want to have every single one effective. Okay. Her rate is interesting, but I've already got a decent amount of both, and, and all of them and will not help the Hyper Boom team at all. Well, all right. Let's just get to it. Hmm. Yeah, apparently no platinum. Fair enough. Mm hmm. Hmm. Yeah. Oh, right. You got Fab Sword. Well, that's okay. Presumably. Thank you, and... Oh my goodness. That... Of course things are just not going. Okay. Cool, we gotta keep battering them. Cool. And blast. And keep on blasting, and we are doing pretty well for ourselves, actually. Hmm. Well, actually... Don't need these ones here that much now. Okay, so we put you down. Keep on... Burgeoning. Thank you. Thank you. And oh my goodness. Alright then. Oh well, now you're burning. Okay then. Mm. Oh, Alright. Do it like this. And just like that. We... What's about to happen? And, oh my goodness. She was. Come on, come on. And there we go. Cool. Cool. And just like this. We keep on blasting. Keep on blasting. Hmm, but the power uh, regeneration is not perfect, that's for sure. Oh, and of course the... Uh, it's a problem too. It's a problem too. And just hit like you here and... Blast! Hit and... Thanks. And put that down and continue burgeoning. Lovely. Okay. I think... Is that already gold? It might already be gold. Definitely go a bit easy here, but I 
You have okay. You do have wolf thing right now. That's good. Come on. No, really, I don't know what's up with my connection here. And luckily, they give a good amount of stuff, so I not too worried. And can I? Thank you. And can I? Okay, nice. And okay, did we get that? We did get that. Good. Good. And hit. Keep on blasting you. And the next is over there. Right. Well, whatever. Come on. Let's shoot you down. We are doing perfectly fine. And ah, just... What is up with the connection right now? I simply do not know. Well, whatever. I cannot... Oh, goodness. Cannot... What? Okay. Just keep on completely losing the ability to do anything here. Well, whatever. And... Oh. Thanks. Okay, cool. And over here, put this down too. And there we have it. Take you out. And cool. Thank you. And right, get a few down. And last is uh, you. Cool. And keep on cutting. Alright, and can I Oh, we actually managed to get a good amount of stuff. Okay, thanks. And... Boom, boom, and... Switch issue actually stopped me from getting that final kill. It does not really matter, but... Still not happy about it. And... Oh, come on. And... What really? Okay. I just... This is real nonsense. And there we are. There we have it. Let's just keep on... Punching, punching, burning, 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 and probably you gotta love it. How much more? Oh, right, we don't really have healing in here, that's right. And, okay, I, all right, put this down, just in case, and, oh, come on, and, thank you, Emily. Punch, and there we go, cool. Cool. Gotta love this. Oh, but the question is whether she'll still first access by the time all of this is done and dusted. <sighs> okay, well, it's like this, we can try some of that. And, oh, please, uh, okay. And I'm away. Oh, nice. You can't sit back quite well. Okay. Cool. And just keep on punching. Keep on punching. And damage bonus is definitely part of this because it's his attack focus. Come on, come on, come on. And we're almost there. Let's do this here. And can I put it down. And she does a good job of it. Very good job of it. And punch. Thank you. And very, very good green numbers. For a sub DPS, it doesn't get much better. Okay. Move on to the next. And we got a pretty good score. Validation to... Interference overgrowth, conducting tests on the Hussaini amplifier under a variety of conditions is your primary objective. We will begin with the most commonly encountered bomb in scenario, the rainforest. But yeah, it gives Fontaine rewards. Okay. Audition, torrential tide, even giant boulders may be smashed to smithereens by rushing waters. Conducting experiments under such conditions will surely demonstrate the reliability of the Hussaini amplifier. Hydro related reaction. What's Sigwin? Well, not happening. And then, kind of very hydro heavy team. That, honestly, it's gonna have to be a hyphen team in somewhere. Hmm. Probably want it in. He's got a lot of shields, but with hydro. Hmm. I want you to run some kind of electrocharged team there, maybe, but some kind of hyper boom is probably the best option there. Hmm. Hmm. That said, a high number of pyro, pyro particles could actually make version decent. I think Toma Burgeon would actually work well there. The funny thing about it is that two out of three of those Dendro teams last time had Hydro on them. Hmm. 
is what I'd use for the last one. It maybe some kind of Tortaglia team. This it's interesting. This who's going to work better where? Hmm. Emily Nahida and Kole. Dual zone. It would be nice to make what special features. Oh, because this had that unstable energy. Oh, but we're killing them too fast for it to matter. That's right. It's funny. I think Virgin would work well on this one. First one and this work better, especially since Xing Chao is would take down that Pyro Abyss Mage shield without any real trouble. This can be a item team. Okay. You, 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 and then of course that team like before. And you, you, you. Question is what goes on the final one? Because it's just. Oh! Yes, you literally forgot that Nuviet existed. Me. Monster list, and then they are fodder. That's a bunch of fodder that Nuviet spin to win would make absolutely trivial, and you know what? We might not have. Baiju might be on that other team, but let's make this happen anyway. Have Sigwin for her healing. That's fine. Alright. And this should be more than good enough. EM. You need EM. You need HP. And a secondary effector. A shield? No. So most of these are basically the same. Okay. And... Oh, elemental damage bonus from healing. That'll work. Cool. And this... Mental reaction. It does work on all of them. It's a pretty reliably good one because defense and crit damage won't do anything while we're still running. That virgin team. Well, won't do much. Won't do anything. It's definitely that strong. I'm glad that Emily was working well. She was definitely pulling her weight. Okay, cool. Thank you, and... Alright. Oh, and this is it. This is that jewel field. Okay, cool. Oh, but... Hmm. Let's see how well we can actually get virgins, and the answer is pretty darn well. Okay. Cool. And... As soon as we get that virgin, we just blast them all to oblivion. Cool. Well, kinda. Hmm. Multiple? Well, okay. Cool, I guess. That should break them down. We a lot of that going. Shouldn't be a huge problem, so let's just keep on and punching. And Virgin is as good as it usually is. Cool. And come on. Come on, field. Dual field. And there we go. Cool. Thank you. It's down and... Okay, nice. Like that. And it... Toma being good, something I will never get over in a good way. It makes my cold black heart rather happy. Okay, thank you, and uh, that is kind of painful. And do I have enough? Or I barely do not have enough. Okay, well we, we're doing quite well for ourselves anyway. And can I... Mm, Close, close, close in the cigar, and, well, we're still going to get that gold, presumably. All right. Hope that the connection stops acting up. And we do not need Sigwin's garbage there. Okay, and thank you, thank you, and just blast all of you, and keep on... Shooting through, and... Oh, there you are. Okay, cool. And get the rest of these. Come on, come on. And... Okay. Cool. 
simple enough. So and, oh, goodness. Thanks. Put our bubble down. Oh, come on. Thank you. And just like this. We swirl that off. And like that, we swirl that off. Thanks. And keep on shooting. And you're over there. And can we... Thanks. Swirl that. And we got you. I feel like I may be taking a little bit longer to make some of her stuff work than I might entirely like, but you know, I'll win. Okay. And push that and uh, the timing of the really okay. Come on. And scroll that and thank you. Just hit that success which is good. And can I Oh, please, come on. And Swirl and can we? Mm, wait. Well, all right. Not as nice as I might have liked. This should still be more than good enough. Okay, and it's like that. We gonna move to that dual field. That down to be safer. We're gonna try to switch out here first. And where are you? Okay, you're right. Here. Thanks. And. Keep on hitting. Cool. And continue. You're right here. Cool. And thanks. And oh, goodness. There we are. And now you're that way and actually getting hit. That actually disables them really, really well. Not have expected that. Okay. Thank you. And you're over there. One. And two. And next is over that way. Thanks, and, well, alright, thanks, and there we are, we got you, and come on, come on, just over there, and oh, ooh, that's dangerous, okay, and well, of course, we had the timing a little bit bad, and now we got you to deal with, okay, and, come on, cool, and now you're next, thanks, and, okay, cool, and now you're next, next, next. Cool. And just a couple more of that. And cool. You're over here, and let's get that, and get that down, and well, okay. And there we go. Another goal. Set the stage, and observation soaring will. Current results indicate that the performance of the Hosseini amplifier is strongly affected by environmental factors. Observation in a more natural environment is advised. This normal attack set opponents. Charger plunging hit opponents. Huh. That's interesting. Early Kino is an intended option there. I. You know. Bet. Actually. Our Lakino team would be pretty much ideal for here. And you'd be able to combine overloads and vapes. Free over vape is tough to pass up. Hmm. I also seem to want you to use Gaming. It's interesting. Monster list. I fire on there would be good. Just trying to think. Xiongyun could also get some free freezes on some of them, which could be nice. Shonyun Bennett. Not very standard team, but I need to put Marshall Singh back on Gaming then. That's right. Hmm. That's Purina, Shonyun. Bennett Gaming. That. Oh, right, because he doesn't have. Weapon on him right now. This won't work for him. Now back on and give him Winnie's Marshal Sang. That he was using before. And. Yep, and the rest is just Marshal Sang pieces. I do, in theory, need to get him a Marshal Sang, or actually Crimson Witch. Is it higher con levels, which I should eventually get? He does. Prefer Crimson Witch. Okay. 
So right now he's at C3, but once we get over here, well, energy is a different thing. That makes it very easy for him to overcap on crit if he's got Serpent Spine, which is his best weapon by far, and Marshall Singh. So there we go, we got more on him. And then official Yai. It's Earl Aquino. Yai. Official Chevros. Chevros right now has. Does she have fab? She does not have fab right now. Okay. Switch that back. Get that fab lance. Then you, Yai actually needs Skyward right now. She's not going to be triggering reactions herself. It's pure bonus damage. This normals and plunge attacks. It if John Yoon and Fury weren't already on the Gaming team. So who do I have who's actually just pure normals? Or charge, actually. Well that I guess I could try using Nuviet. Oh, but official's not available right now. Hmm. Charge and plunging attacks. True damage shockwave, but I think they probably want you to be using. You can find a way to use Zhongli, I guess. But who? Who? Well, actually, normals, charge, and plunging, it... Hu Tao does all of those. That's right. Why don't I do that? Why don't I bring Hu Tao back out to play? I'm gonna put you in, and Hu Tao should still have the right weapon. You got that stupid thing. Take that back. And we've maxed out our motor force. You want... Hmm. Honestly, probably ER. Then... You want... Definitely attack. This wants... Probably HP. Then... EM and bonus. EM won't do much. That's good. That'll work. Healing won't help. This... Yeah, that works really well if you have... Well, it... True is a reaction. That won't take long. And then... Crit rate and... We finally can actually use this because we don't have a team. It's just reaction only. Okay. Hmm... All right then. Let's see how this is working. And there we are. All 12 different characters. Let's see how all this team works, and hopefully the connection is not going to be wrong for me. Oh, what's that special feature though? I did not actually see that. Well, okay. Thanks. And can we burst and. Cool, and, oh right, you're over here, which is actually good for me, and can I continue plunging, or this is fine, and now we cross again, and there we go. Okay, here you are. This is doing decent. And it does seem like the connection is a little less of a problem as it was last time. And there we are. That will kill and blast him. Oh, well, you're in a bad position for me. Well, alright. Thanks, and shoot again, and now you're over here, and then over this way, and now we... Well, okay. Mm -hmm. Just want to make sure... Oh, that was a painful connection issue. Come on. There we go. Good, and now healing. Then we gumming again, and oh, that did not hit him at all. Okay, cool. And blast, and hit, and... Hit again, and can I hit and blast? Cool. 
Now, if you're gonna come back, and we've already got what we need for the goal. No. And, uh, what is up with the connection right now? I hope it's better by the time I... Well, I didn't get that plunge off. Sad. Hmm. Got this team. And I wonder what's up with that one. What's the... Still features energy clusters. Attack, damage increase, is defeated, drift away, attach. It's a percentage for the time they drift. Okay, well, it's not a huge problem. Okay. Well, let's... Oh, goodness. I wish Hutal was better. Well, whatever, that's a lot. Oh, nice. Welcome back. Glad to hear that your headphones are now fully charged. And there we are. Thank you. Go over, try my best to let the energy recharge before. Thanks, and dodge. Oh, it, she's just very underpowered in this day and age. The meta has outpaced her to a real degree. It's sad, you know? I like too bad. I feel like it's maybe a ping issue right now that her stuff is expiring. Well, I don't know. Just haven't gotten nearly as much Paramita Papilio time. This is not Abyss. It's not Abyss Tower, so to speak. This is Energy Amplifier Lemma, which is one of the currently current events going on right now. It's a combat event, not the Finch minigame one. Which, Finch minigame one is fun. Well, you haven't played the game in literal years. I would not expect it to be all that significant. You're free. You're free now. Let's hit and... Mm, top. Well, we got one more. For whatever reason, my connection is a little haywire right now, and I don't know why. The good news is Emily is actually very capable. Not amazing, amazing, but definitely good at what she does. She's only going to get better, because Natlan is kind of suited towards some of the stuff she does. There are there's some characters who are going to work very well with her, so... That's interesting. I'm pretty excited. Because, well, it's character I have, and I like it when characters I have are good. Okay, and put this back down. Thank you, fish. And what's a shoot? And oh, that did not hit a damn person. Okay, so where is your next? We can get lots of reactions off. Nice, and you're over there. More reactions. One, two, three, four. Okay, Arlequino's good too. Watch and. Oh wow! They actually restricted your phone? But not the Chromebook? Fair. It. If you don't like the grind, I guess it is kind of a more interesting game to watch than play sometimes. Maybe. Well, it depends on what you like about it, frankly. Oh, they didn't know you had YouTube on the Chromebook? I mean, I didn't. Well, I guess it makes sense, but I just never thought about it. It may surprise you, but I don't really think about Chromebooks much. Green for, except in the sense of Chromebooks bad, people with Chromebooks deserve better. And cool, let's actually just blast this. Get a bit more damage in there. Well, that... Mm. Well, what did that do? And there we have it. Pretty high score and a gold medal. Rule Breaker? Oh, you're... That is right. I keep forgetting that you set your name to white. Good to see you again. I... How does your child feel about your scolding? Collection High Energy Elements. It appears that the conditions prevalent in ordinary environments are entirely insufficient to test the limits of Hosseini Amplifier. High Energy Testing should be undertaken next. Okay, well, I'll take your word for it. Elemental Skill and Elemental Burst Damage by 25%. This is interesting. Attack increased by 20%, each opponent defeated, max 5 stacks. So that... Well, I think... The Arlequino team would work well in this one, too. Big thing is you're not supposed to repeat characters. Or if you do, you can only repeat one character without missing out on the major buffs in the mode. It's a fun event. It gets me to use all of my characters, which... I'm not the trial guy. This guy. My guy. Oh, come on. Need to take them all off now. And reset the order. I hate my stupid life. It! That's the, that's the most important kind of scolding. Making sure people stay safe. 
The others are significantly less important, I would say. Then, so then there's one that's just a damage without any other real issues, but... Well, skill bonus, actually, that's really good for... The Alhytham team. But this... The Alhytham team would be good here. So it's mostly dendro damage, which... That team would deal with well. I just need to make sure I don't get element checked too hard here. It... I like that Alhytham is still good. He's still very, very competitive. That... Otsu? What does Otsu mean? Those kind of mean Otsu, or at least they translate to Otsu. What does that mean in that case? Either way... Let me see, let me think. We need skill, but we don't have Ike. I guess I could try... You know what? We're bringing back Raiden National. Raiden National is back in a big way. It's been so long since I last used this team. Feels good, actually. So catch and then right battle to the fjords on Zhang Ling, especially since he isn't going to have energy issues on this team. And everything else on there should probably be able to stay. Wait, what? Well, it. I don't. I don't know what to say. I think you probably didn't hear that. But you might, you might actually be that. It's okay. I think we'll live. Okay, so let's get this started in this. Definitely attack. Definitely EM. Definitely... Energy recharge may... Eh, I don't know. It buff Raiden. And this healing won't help. Damage by skills and burst. No, this is good. This EM, this... Honestly, EM could be good here, too. This, we go for crit. There we go. How many emotes do you just have lying in wait? Just constantly handy. It, and then you're getting your attack boost, which is a little worrisome. Oh, come on. There is a non-zero chance that death actually happens to you. It's not good. And come on, come on. And once we get Kino's back, and oh my goodness, this is... Actually, just evil. How much damage can I just pump out with this team? Twitch on light mode? I mean, I do. Because for me, if I've got stuff like that going on, I... Oh, and of course it's dead. If I'm watching something, it's... I'm not trying to sleep. If I'm trying to sleep, then I'm not trying to watch stuff. It... What does that mean? What does that even mean? Okay, and two, three, four, and one, two. Somehow I feel slightly confused and a little afraid. Thank you, and okay, let's put this back on. And, uh, something is, is constantly up with the connection here. Arlequino has some problems with wacky healing, but it's nice that you can do that dash leave to get him closer. Thank you, and one, two, three, four, and one, two, three. Get that pretty conveniently. Guy is not using reverse on this team. And there we go, and just sweep in and get a couple more kills. And that was only the first round. It. You know, me too. I heard about the car accident, and I was rather worried. It was certainly something, I'll say that much. But at this point, you know, I just. I, th I think I've learned to just live and let live in that case, you know, just... They can live their own life and as riskily as they like, and you know, that's... You just gotta deal with it. And... Okay, well, that... Interesting, and... There we go! The cooldowns are kind of hard. Okay, well... Good luck with that. And one, two, three... Ah, but hitting... Hitting is hard here, and uh, doing circle impact with Bennett is not all that great here. Uh, well, let's get this down, and... Mm, you can go, and you are up to your next. Thank you, and... You! You forgive quickly. I'd say that's a virtue. Three, and one, two, there we go. That should time those combos very correctly. Take that down, get that down. And it's 
We have some very, very good teams right now. This is incredible. I... I am really excited for not long gameplay. Stuff they've shown with the dragons looks really, really cool. Big thing I'm excited for, honestly, is... Uh, a lot of the character kits look really, really unorthodox and interesting. Because Milani's whole deal is that she surfs at people. That you have to hit enemies with her surfboard to charge up a big single hit. Which also means that she's the first character who can actually reliably run forward vape. As in vaporized reactions with... Oh. Uh, that is, you know... Hydro on Pyro, which deals more damage in theory but consumes more aura. And then Kanich basically plays like a Kingdom Hearts character, people are saying. That's the perspective a lot of people have. But either way, I'm very, very excited to see how things go. I did not expect to get it. Whatever. Thank you. And please do not buff up. Please, please. There we go. And this should be good and lead to more spawning. That... That's a very interesting word to use there. I'm a little confused. Is it as in hurt or as in gently touched? I... These are difficult conversations. And... Thank you, and... Oh, but the healing is not... I... What am I supposed to do? What am I supposed to say here? I don't know. Okay. Take you down. We've broken the 10k. That's nice. It's just so many very, very strong teams are on right now. It. I wouldn't say that this is sort of my apex, but I'm doing very, very well with what I currently have. And that's all. Okay, cool. Collection high energy elements, and there is no platinum metal. I think they got rid of platinum metals because it made people feel bad. Literally. Pardon you. Pardon Kozu. The extension polyphasic excitation. In theory, the Hosseini amplifier can simultaneously conduct and excite elemental potential within people. This experiment is intended to prove precisely this. One, two, three, and above elemental types. Interesting. Oh, elemental damage bonus. That actually should not be all that hard to make work. Because that... Let's get one thing of a resonance. Attack of opponents within a certain radius by 20%. All elemental. Interesting. All opponents, including themselves, or... Definitely want to have... A high from team on the last one there. It is fun trying to target my teams to the buffs. This is a good team. And then the standard Furina, Baizu, Kazuha, Furina team should also work. Not on here, because... Heavy things with heavy hydro resistance it should work here. So that's Furina, Baiju, Kaza, not Wander, or Nuviat. And the final team I'm trying to run here would be. Tough to say. Some that doesn't target Hydro or Animo. Honestly, a Hytham team might work good here too. Pick thing is, I'm trying to think of a team that works well that. You know, honest to goodness, maybe I'll just run that Emily team again. Wouldn't be much of a reason not to. There's a team with... Well, Rathesley's on there, but he's not a huge part of it. And then, you, you, good old Emily. It... I like the fact... I've talked about this before, but a lot of people thought when they heard that Emily was going to be a burning-oriented character, she would specifically buff the burning reaction. She doesn't. She just deals more damage to burning opponents. But I I actually like that in the sense that it focuses, especially since she has decent dendro application, it focuses the effect of burning on not the damage of burning itself, which is nominal. Because aside from Furina and Monas, I mean Aika and Monas Prince, there's not really a good way, or any real way at all, to... No, she wants Fav. Good way to apply elements without dealing damage. And it does enable interesting things like, I don't know, sometimes being able to get, I guess, a melt or a vaporizer on a burn. Maybe. But okay, so all of these ones are ones where HP. That's, yeah. Crit is going to be good for all of these. I ran an interesting 
Virgin E team on the first couple challenges out of the six. There was also a PvP Finch Ball sort of shuffleboard minigame, which I did okay in. I got screwed sometimes. It was alright. Skills, burst, healing for the bonus. That's good. That might actually, that should be... Uh, the EM is good. The EM's still good there. This'll work. Let's try this again. Gosh, it... A lot of people complain about how weird and bespoke character kits get. There was a meme I saw some time ago that was joking about Ark Knight's boss year one, Ark Knight's boss year five. And it... The description of abilities was just crazy, crazy long. And the most infamous one is Fire Emblem Heroes, so that's mostly because of power creep, intentional power creep. Yeah, it... There's a reason this is my only live service game, really. I do not have time for any others. But, I enjoy myself. I try to, at least. Oh, they got hyper on me. Okay. Well... The big thing is, is... Just, you know a few basic team archetypes in your build. That's really about it. Though that can be a tall order for people sometimes, too. Come on. And you're over there. Get that back. Come on, spin a win, spin a win. And that did not do all that much damage. Well, all right. Hmm. But, the big thing with... Uh, Genshin, is that, generally speaking, the way you win is by trying to use as many new characters as possible. I mean, that is generally how Gasha tends to work, for better or worse. But I think... For better or worse... I need to stop saying better or worse, but... The way that they encourage you to use new characters is by making them better suited to new content. And the issue is, is that, quite honestly... Giving you the ability to get new characters is the only real reward they can give. And the fact that Nima Gems exist, currency exists in general, is an okay-ish way to get around issues of rewards in open world games. Because the problem with, you know, Breath of the Wild is that they don't have a lot of good rewards. That's what people always said about Breath of the Wild and Tears of the Kingdom. And with Elden Ring, it's interesting because they have a lot more unique weapons. But a lot of rewards are just crafting materials and not particularly good ones at that. And that can lead to similar levels of fatigue, but with Genshin, you, know, you get a Prima Gem, it's always going to be useful. You never don't want Prima Gems, but it's just a sort of, well, alright. It also means you need Prima Gems to an extent that people don't necessarily enjoy or appreciate. It... It's interesting, you know, there, there's no such thing as a perfect video game. There are video games that are probably better than others, but it, any game is going to end up having trade-offs of a sort between various priorities and design, because, you know, among other things, a game for everyone is a game for no one. But it's impossible to make a game that truly satisfies every single person. Meaning... Is this yet? The length... The time that her burst is active... I mean, her skill is active is incredible. It's literally Archon 2. So Emily may not be the Dendro Archon. Especially since she does not have a reaction-focused kit. But it's interesting how good she is at what she does anyway. I think I might have mentioned this before, but her deal is non-reaction dendro damage. She very specifically does not want to trigger other dendro reactions, which would mostly mean, well, quicken, aggravate, bloom, hyperbloom, etc. Well, the only ones dendro itself can trigger are burning, bloom, and spread, and quicken. But she just deals more damage to enemies who are currently burning. Which means that she's very focused on using Burning as a way to maintain Pyro Aura for characters who need Padro, such as Rathesley Reverse Melt, which is what I was running her on just now. But you can also use that for stuff like Burgeon, which by virtue of needing Pyro also means that... Oh goodness, that's... Oh, issue. An issue. Virtue of needing Pyro also means you're going to end up getting Burning procs, which... 
I might have said this before, but there's a character in not long, Keen Age coming up, second half in the next patch, whose entire deal is also kind of triggering Bloom and Burden. I mean, Burgeon and Burning as his modest operata on teams, which is not... He's interesting, because like Emily, he also focuses on big Dendro numbers. But, like I said, it's going to be interesting to see how he works as a character. His fighting style is very similar to very specifically. Apparently, this is an informed attribute because I've never actually played Kingdom Hearts myself, though I aim to rectify that sooner than later. He fights like Sora's wisdom form transformation or so, I've been told. Which is, you know, sort of spinning around the enemy shooting projectiles and sometimes doing big hits. That's his whole thing. He basically sets up a grappling hook to hit the en to latch onto an enemy of some size. It... You really don't. If you want to, you can. But there are equal reasons not to do that. If you're interested, I'd say that... I like this game for a number of reasons. In particular, it's mixed audience, and the fact that the gameplay is has some depth without being incredibly stressing. Stressful. Exceedance, resonance, amplification. The Hassani amplifier's performance has fallen far short of expectations. In multi-element trials, perhaps experience should first be conducted on just two specific elements. Hmm. Two specific swirl or crystallize. Interesting. Huh. Once every one second. That means all elemental damage bonus. That just means having swirl or crystallize in the team. Because all the bonuses are the same. HP of the effective opponent with highest current HP, so it's very AoE focused. That's fair. I... Most games end up, for better or worse, being more fun if you spend on them at least a little. That's... They're designed to drain your money. But for me, it's just sort of... Buying the Battle Pass whenever it comes out, as well as the monthly Gem Pass, costs... About as much, actually a little less than a yearly, as in doing that for a year, costs a little less than a subscription to something like Final Fantasy XIV. And even though I have a lot of friends who play that game, my thought process is basically, I play this or I play XIV, I already play this game, I don't want to switch. And it, to be fair, it's taken some luck, but I've gotten a good amount of characters. This one needs Geo in it. The others probably be better off using a team with Animo. They're not necessarily Animo focused, but this definitely wants Geo. Navi is going in second. Not you, and then it's Bennett and Fischl for that team. Okay. I'm sure, Navi has got the spine. This fun weapon right here. And then, other than that, we have... Wait, wait. And this one is a bunch of trash. But actually, given how much has auras on it, I probably want Kaza on that team and then have Zhao on this one. So that'd be... Furina... Farazan... Sean Yoon slash Collide Retainer, and then Zhao. And then... Hmm, Zhao needs his deathmatch back. And I wonder... I think Farazan has the wrong Fathbo on right now. Wrong is in lower... Refines, but... Oh, that's right! I totally forgot that... They've still got their bonuses active. Because of Imaginary and Theater giving them bonuses. That's right. So this one up here, the first one. Kaza or Venti needs to be in there. I... Probably Kaza, honestly. Well, it... If I can get things set up correctly... I think Venti would actually be better, which means... It may be time to actually bring Morgana back from the grave. That it's pretty nice actually. Gani should yeah, Gani definitely still has her artifacts, so then it's Venti and Mona. 
Mona, actually, no, she shouldn't need anything more about Bav Codex. And Thrilling Tales could work, but actually, just to be sure, I probably want to give her the good Fav Codex. Because Thrilling Tales wouldn't do all that much. This is an option too, but that stays on Baiju semi-permanently. So now we're at maximum there. So this, it's definitely EM here. This one is... Ooh, attack. Can't do much of there. It's interesting how oh, they don't have anything crit related except for this central one. That said, given that Kanye was still going to be part of the damage of that Morgana team, I probably still want to go for the crit bonus at the end. We'll see what happens. This is... Defense... No, attack prompt. Maybe energy recharge, actually. Uh, yeah, actually. Just in case. This... Skill burst. Yeah, that's good. That would really help now, yeah. This needs... ER, EM, I mean, that would be useful. Plunging, plunging, plunging. That's... That'll work. Well, actually, this this is better. And we'll go for this. Okay. Actually, every single one of these teams should be... Aww. Yeah, that should work. Well, it... Either way, I'm getting the gold. I shouldn't have a problem getting the gold, at least. Just gotta make sure we find a way to... We're everything into the middle. We gotta get them lined up. And... I interesting. That was some trouble. And can I? There we go. Oh well, we actually did kind of okay for ourselves. Okay, on to the next. Almost. And there we go. This is the classic Ganyu team. It honestly, Ganyu needs a bot, but I just don't know how they do it. You know, you know that feeling? And put that down. Oh well. Let's just get a couple of shots off. And there we have it. And once down it gets reversed back, we try that again. And we're doing okay for ourselves. It, it, Morgana is still theoretically really good. The issue is just... So much of the game content is specifically oriented around making Morgana not good because of how good it is. If it isn't actively nerfed, it becomes one of the best and most, not oppressive, but just one of the most powerful archetypes in the game by far. Because anytime there are a bunch of characters, you just blast them all into the circle. A big black hole and can't do much. So it's really just a... Alright, it's... If Morgan is good, it's really, really good. If Morgan is bad, it's useless. Because with Inazuma, they just started introducing more and more characters who couldn't meaningfully be suctioned up. And more low AoE or just completely single-target boss chambers. So before that, Venti was just undeniably probably the best character in the game, except maybe Jean-Louis Postbuff. After they fixed Geo Resonance, which originally, before I even started playing, was... Literally just increased poise, which is as ridiculous as it sounds, and useless as it sounds, too. Oh, well, okay. Thanks. I oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Get all these. And blast you. Two. Three. One. Two. Or not. And there are all the golems. This is why Navi is here. Okay, cool. Blast that down, and we got a good amount of energy recharge, so... One, two. Oh, nice. One, two, and... There we are! That was really nice. Okay. Take you down. It... I will say, for all its flaws, I do legitimately enjoy the game. And its gameplay specifically. It... If you're not interested in the gameplay just like the characters, it's simply not the game for you. As much as it hurts to say. Because there are a lot of people who try to make things a bit more newbie-friendly. But, if you don't enjoy the gameplay, it's very much a sort of, there's 
there's so much gameplay that you're not going to enjoy things. You catch my drift. Because they've tried making things less competitive, less stressful, less pressure to, you know, compete and succeed, but... I think a lot of it is also just... They have a lot of market simply due to being the first on the scene as the first big-budget, high-production-value Gasha that are only really around because... It was first on the scene, there was a lot of, frankly, peer pressure to get involved. But, even still, it, a wide audience is generally the most profitable way to run things. And it... Oh, oh shit. This is kind of annoying. And where are you next? Okay, over there. Okay, and keep on plunging. Thank you, and... Very nice bonus. Very nice bonus. Thank you, Fiorina. Yep. Pretty darn good team to run. Just in general and even here. It, it is really funny how much of a special boy Zhao is. And how many characters end up being direct or indirect Zhao buffs. You know, everyone's favorite Italian is a big Zhao stan, so it's... I assume she's happy. I mean, I don't mind. I, I like Zhao too. Quandra's fun. But, so we're still doing well. I'll just collect all rewards, and I just want to see how many. Oh, come on. How many rolls I'll have to not run at that point. And, uh, not being able to switch adequately is really hurting. My ability to just dodge an iframe through attacks. Well, whatever. At least he's got. Oh, these are not enough to poise break him. Thank you, and. Just over here, we can keep plunging and kill a number, presumably. And, well, he did decently. One almost died, and another goal. Let's just collect all rewards and be done with it after checking, of course. How many rolls I've got next time? Because I did get lucky, not to brag and get. Oh. Emily winning the 50 50, which is nice. Which means that I've got. Oh, a very nice amount of rolls set up for not one already. And since next patch is going to be the anniversary patch, it's going to be even better. Let's take a look at some of that, and that's done. So, yeah, we have... There are only six characters I don't have, though to be fair, that's most because I've been at this for a long time. Excuse me. That's just the fried rice. I like cooking. I'd say I'm a pretty good cook. That has nothing to do with anything. So right now, after 16,000... 13, 3, 5, 7... That's almost elite. 13, 3, 5, 7, that's... 8. You know what? Let's divide that garbage. 13, 3, 5, 7 divided by 160. It's 183 in there right now. And this is... 59. It's 242 in the tank already, which means, assuming, even if I got really unlucky, I should still be able to get both the new characters, Mawadi and Kinich, next patch, which should be really nice because of how important they'll be for exploration in the new region. But either way, this is a pretty good stopping point. I think I will hop off here and talk to you all later. Always nice to chat and... Got anything you want to say or do before I leave? Speak now or forever hold your peace. But otherwise, I think I'll just be chilling. Alright, I should put Scoured back on Wanderer and Deathmatch back on Emily before I close things out. Just because I'll be using them for my dailies for the foreseeable future. Yeah, that'll be... Oh, and wait, Avatar 4. Right, the Emily avatar, because we got Emily now. So I'll see you later, and yeah, Santa Ragan. See you around. Oh my goodness, I did not know that I was stuck in a frown. My goodness. See ya.